Hi team! Uh, I said I wasn't going to make a training video today because I shared you that awesome um, training by the Glow sisters. So, but I lied. I'm making samples like I said I was going to do. I'm going to make my, my 5010. I'm going to start the 50 today. Uh, and I thought I would just show you guys how I make my samples. Um, they're really easy, really simple, very basic. They don't look pretty. I don't use molds, any of that kind of stuff. I will use molds sometimes um, to make like larger samples, like a deluxe sample for my customers to include in their actual orders. But as far as just handing out to strangers, I'm not super worried about uh, what the actual samples look like. And I'm not giving them enough to melt in their warmers necessarily. It's just for them literally to sniff our stuff. We want to get the fragrance under people's noses. We sell fragrance, right? So people have to smell, smell it uh, if they want to buy it. So I am literally just focused on giving them enough that they can smell through this little baggie. Uh, and then if they want to order some to melt in their warmers, they could purchase it from me. So here's the full bar. I literally just crack it open. So the reason I started doing it this way instead of using candy molds or, or silicone molds, I used to do those. Um, I just, honestly, I have a busy life. I have things to do, uh, places to be. So I would much prefer to focus my time on other areas of my business, like supporting you guys, uh, rather than taking hours just to make samples. So I thought if there's anyone out there with you guys um, who aren't making samples or aren't handing out samples because they just don't know where to begin, um, something is better than nothing. So I thought I would just show you what I do. So sample, little knife. Okay, it's just a sharp little like it's a paring knife. They don't always come out pretty, so it might not here either. And there's different ways you could do it. I'm going to try and do little thin ones. Um, you see, it's just shaving it off, so that might not work. So I'll just put it into chunks like how I normally do. Chop off a chunk. And then I'll literally just take this chunk and turn it into tiny chunks. Okay, chunky chunkers. There's another one. I literally just do this, you guys. I chop up the bar. Um, like I said, it's not pretty, but it's enough for them to smell. Sorry, my allergies are so bad if you guys can hear that. Ooh, I sound like I'm permanently sick. Uh, it's enough for them to smell, and that's all we really want. Um, like I said, for my actual customers, I'll give them cute little samples in their bags uh, to reward them for, for ordering through me and to thank them. Uh, and I'll give them enough so they can actually warm in their warmers because it's it's a sample for them, but it's also a little bit of a gift for, for placing their order with me. So I just take those little chunks. That's one little cube. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. That's about fourteen. I could even probably take some of those chunks and even make them smaller, which I'm gonna do. So fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, there, eighteen samples out of one little cube. That's still seven cubes to go, y'all. Okay, so that's it. You see that? Tiny, teeny, tiny. So I will attach this to my business card. Um, and then I will attach the business card to this. Normally I would put these in, you know, like the bigger versions of these bags you could get. You get one actually that's about this size. I would normally put it right in that bag. My back door just opened by itself, that's weird. Uh, but I don't have any of those bags right now. So I'm going to just attach the business card right to this. I'm going to put a scent of the month sticker like this. Where'd the bag go? Here it is. Just on the outside of the bag, just cause it's easy peasy. I learned that uh, a little while ago. I really like that system. Uh, so now my sample is labeled. They know what they're getting and it's sort of an extra little smelly too, which is fun. And that's that. And then I'll just hand these out to people that I meet in the line at the grocery store or the teachers, like I said today, I'm working the breakfast club all week this week. Uh, so I'll hand a bunch of these out to the teachers, just wherever. And it's a product list. These are cheapy cheap. My business cards are cheapy cheap. And this is TD tiny. So even if you're on the smallest TD tiniest budget, uh, you can still make these work and you can still get your fragrance under people's noses. So I thought I would just share that. Let me know if you guys have any questions uh, and have a great day. Bye.